a virtual interview now i think many of us are talking about us and wanting to know how we can ace a virtual interview so let's get down seriously and know how to ace a virtual interview a virtual interview is a digital technique that allows employers to remotely assess the suitability of a candidate via a video link virtual interviews are usually performed as a first stage screening method used to narrow down the pool of applicants invited to the next stage of the recruitment process a virtual interview can be conducted in one of the two ways a live two way conversation between employer and candidate held via a digital conferencing platform or a video chat application such as skype zoom or go to meeting the second could be a one way session where the applicant is presented with preset questions and required to provide the answers through video recording software a virtual interview brings many benefits to a hiring organization they are cost effective easy to set up and unlike telephone interviews they offer the employer a visual impression of the candidate's interpersonal skills they also provide a greater reach by eliminating geographical obstacles in the search of talent for the candidate a virtual interview also offers benefits over traditional face to face meetings and phone interviews many people feel more confident and comfortable in a familiar environment a virtual interview allows you to present yourself from a location of your choice whether that be at home or another suitable space such as private study or a meeting room a virtual interview can reduce stress by removing the need for travel it eliminates the potential added pressure of train delays or traffic jams as well as saving your travel associated costs unlike a telephone interview a virtual interview gives you the chance to present yourself in full positive body language and a confident demeanor can increase your chance of progressing to the next stage just as an employer's talent pool is widened by a virtual interview so too is your job search traveling a long distance to attend a first stage interview in presence can be impractical especially if you are unsure of your chance of progression so tips for acing your virtual interview let's have 10 going your way best practice for virtual interviews include the same methods of preparation as any form of interviews you should conduct thorough research on the hiring organization be sure you understand its industry and are aware of its objectives cultures and values so important you should also be familiar with the specifics of the post for which you are applying and prepare for any role related questions you think you may be asked as well as rehearsing answers for general competency based questions in addition to the basics there are some unique challenges to address in your virtual interview preparation here we begin before arrange your setup there are two main factors to the setup of virtual interview equipment and location you will want either a desktop or a laptop never attend a virtual interview via smartphone please avoid that with quality audios and video capabilities don't assume that your computers built in speakers and webcam are sufficient test them out and if you encounter any issues look to buy or borrow additional equipment when choosing your location make sure it's private and as soundproof as possible as any external noise will be distraction for both you as well as the interviewer ensure that your backdrop is suitable and the lighting is appropriate you'll also want to be sure that your chosen location has a relevant internet capacity and preferably a wired connection as this will decrease the chances of drop out before rehearse for the virtual environment a virtual interview can feel like an old process especially if you are unfamiliar with for example a face to face interview would normally begin and conclude with a handshake this is not possible in a virtual environment so practice a professional greeting such as a slight nod or a subtle raising of your hand it's also important to practice talking into the camera instead of looking at 
here and there on the screen make a focus and talk to that particular focus on screen virtual eye contact is a difficult skill to master but if you can achieve it you will make a much better impression before be fully prepared you will want complete confidence that everything will go well so make a checklist of everything you need to consider and make sure all actions are completed before the interview starts test your equipment and connection and double check your surroundings make sure you will encounter no unexpected disturbances and neatly lay out everything you need on your desk as with any interviews dress appropriately and do so in full while it might be tempting to only smarten the upper half dressing professionally from head to toe will put you in the right mindset crucially make sure you have a glass of water to hand the last thing you want is to have a pause the interview if your mouth goes dry before plan your time effectively for a virtual interview it's important to plan your time accordingly and be ready and waiting to join the call it can be tempting to leave it until the last minute since there's no travel involved but ideally you should clear your schedule at least an hour beforehand to focus your mind on the task at hand use the time to go over your research notes reread the job description and remind yourself of your initial application this should get you fully focused and interview ready fifth during watch our body language while attending a virtual interview from the comfort of your home can make you feel more confident it can also make you feel too relaxed be sure to constantly maintain a good posture and keep your body language professional also be aware of the interviewer's field of vision if you are trying to emphasize a point with hand gestures that can't be seen it can create a disconnected atmosphere try and keep your movement minimal but natural don't overly gesticulate but don't sit too rigidly either during maintain your focus it's far easier to drift off or get distracted in a virtual interview than it is sit face to face with another person the fact that you are online can prove a big distraction in itself so be sure to avoid any temptation to browse or check your emails it's also good practice to turn off notification as part of your virtual interview preparation there can also be a temptation to play around with things the interviewer can't see like your phone or doodle on a piece of paper just because the interviewer can't see what you are doing doesn't mean they won't notice you are distracted or your distraction stay fully focused on the process at hand and what is being asked of you during the seventh one try and build a connection remember if you are partaking in a virtual interview it's likely you are one of many candidates being screened for the next round so you'll need to make an impression as it can be difficult to make a personal connection via virtual means this aspect of the interview will take a little more effort a good tip is to do a bit of background research on your interviewer and see if there's any common ground you can build on such as a mutual interest it's also important to ensure your personality come across well in a face to face interview you give a lot of yourself away through your natural presence in a virtual interview there is a barrier and you will need to go that extra mile to build a rapport eight during the interview let the interviewer lead dead air time can seem like an eternity compared to moments of face to face silence so there can often be a temptation to fill gaps in the conversation avoid this urge and let the interviewer lead the process it could be that they are taking the time to jot down some notes or there may simply be a delay in the transmission be patient and wait for the prompt before you speak unnecessary chat can derail the whole interview process ninth after follow up and ask for feedback 
as with any form of interview it's both professional and courteous to follow up in the aftermath of your virtual interview thank those involved for their time and for considering you for the role and be sure let them know you are open to providing further information should they need it if you are unsuccessful in moving to the next stage be sure to ask for feedback to help your future performance if you are new to the virtual interview process you could even ask for feedback specific to the virtual element to see if there's anything you can improve upon then after review your performance take the time to assess what you think went well and what you would have improved on this is standard practice for any interview format be it virtual or a physical but it is especially important for a virtual interview where there are additional factors to consider in some instances you may even be permitted to record the interview and watch it back at a later date this will be down to the employer though so be sure to seek written permission to do so in advance mistakes to avoid to ace a virtual interview there are few common mistakes that should be avoided don't get flustered if technology fails you this is a common pitfall of a virtual interview stay calm and attempt to reconnect don't fidget this can appear unprofessional and be a distraction if you are particularly nervous try holding a stress ball under the desk which is not seen by an interviewer don't use a civil chair or a chair with wheels you could end up swinging from side to side or altering your position without even realizing don't have programs or downloads running in the background this can slow down your connection and disrupt the interview don't forget to ask questions despite being two way a live virtual interview can often feel one sided treat it as you would in a face to face interview and ask insightful question that demonstrates your enthusiasm and to sum it up virtual interviews are becoming increasingly popular thanks to the benefits they bring to the employers many large corporations have included a virtual interview as part of their standard procedure for some time but they are now being used by many smaller organization to save time and cut cost If you are invited to a virtual interview it's important to approach it with the same professional mindset as you would with face to face meeting be prepared calm and confident and crucially ensure you have the right equipment connection and procedures in place take the time to practice and perfect how to ace a virtual interview to give yourself the best chance of success i hope you do it because it's time for you to deliver it when it matters the most so prepare the only thing that you can possibly take home or drive home is plan prepare practice and deliver best wishes thank you